I guess the year started slow for me. A lot of repairs, a lot of phone calls to customer service, and a lot of follow-ups. I've been living in the province for the past three months and coming back to the city, it took me a while to adjust but during this week, I felt some progress. Today is Saturday, February 13, and today we're going to for the very first time. So let's see. Okay, I'm already dressed up, and kaya lang, there's a sudden situation na biglang hindi kami makalabas agad because it's raining. So tignan natin maya maya. Two hours later. Okay, after a few hours of waiting, it's time to go. Tapos na mulan. So it's currently 1 p.m. or usually yung plan namin is to go out between uh, 6 30 a.m. to 7 a.m. Pero nat na di kami natuloy since umulan niya. So now, let's go. That was my first long bike ride around the city. It's probably a 25 kilometer bike ride back and forth. Hindi ko alam if na ba yon, but it was the farthest bike ride for me. It was also the first time I met my college friend, si Amante, in over a year. So it was fun catching up with an old friend na matagal ko nang hindi nakita. And after our bike ride, I decided to join yung company of friends niya that I just met for the very first time. And nag-dinner kami and naglaro kami ng board games. And toto lang, I'm still questioning myself if tama ba na nakipagkita na ako ngayon sa mga new people. Pero if I'm being very honest with myself, I really enjoyed yung social interaction with friends and new people. Kasi it's what, 10 long months na na family ko lang yung nakita ko and nakakausap ko and feeling ko and na ako sa limit ng capacity ko na sila lang yung social interaction ko. So, ayun. Again, I'm not promoting you to go out freely and carelessly, but at the very least, at least, uh, practice your minimum health standards natin whenever you decided to go out and meet out with your friends. Then, last Monday, February 15, I worked with my friend for his collab with the watch brand, and here are some shots that I took. Then, the next day, Tuesday, February 16, I was hired by my friend to be their photographer para dun sa wedding ng kuya niya. And again, here are some samples of my favorite photos that I took. For me, this is important kasi this is one of my original goals for the year. And that is to work as a freelance photographer slash videographer slash editor. And somehow, alam mo, it's, it's starting to manifest. And ito talaga yung business or, or venture na minimension ko dun sa first video ko for the year. Then yung mga business ideas ko with my friends and sa sarili ko, I hope ma-execute ko yun really well. And if nag-succeed yun, I'll share it to this channel. And if mag-fail sa akin na lang yun. The idea came from the circumstance na sobrang dami kong friends and Facebook friends na na-engage with their partner last year, the year of 2020. So sobrang dami talaga na-engage. And I had the idea na gusto kong mag-work with them. I wanted to make pre-enough videos para sa kanila. Pero alam ko din naman sa sarili ko na it will take time para ma-execute yung idea na yun. Kasi kailangan ko muna mag-build ng pre portfolio ko. So medyo matatagalan pa yun. So I asked myself, tanong ko sa sarili ko, uh, what else pa ba yung gusto kong gawa ng video? Or what else do I want to make content of? And turns out, gusto kong gumawa ng content not just video but also photos for small businesses mainly yung mga product based businesses yung mga small local businesses natin and gusto ko din gumawa ng uh, real estate uh, videos yung mga property videos kasi I have a lot of friends na nag-work sa real estate industry and I think yung skill ko dito sa paggawa ng video would be a good complement para dun sa, sa business nila para dun sa mga property listings nila I actually invested on a stabilizer or a gimbal a few weeks ago so I need to make my investment worth it and I know naman na this is an equipment that would help me make the videos that I want to deliver especially sa real estate videos and prenup videos. Lastly, the owner of Alpha Gen's Leather reached out to me, si Joseph, and he was thanking me for the video that I made last month and nakatulong daw sa kanya yon and it drives some traction and attention to his business. Yung message na yun made me really happy, it made me, it made me glad. Uh, and I think yung proper term is it made me fulfill, it gives me fulfillment. Kasi, I mean, after making a few hundreds of YouTube videos, minsan, tatanoy mo na yung mo eh. Why I'm still making YouTube videos? And 
pagkasagot mo lang uh, para magkaroon ng more views, more subscribers, more uh, attention. Parang ang shallow nun para sa akin, parang walang sense, walang kwenta, di ba? So, to hear and read na yung, yung video na ginagawa mo or yung ginagawa kong video is, is making a positive impact on somebody else's life. It's really encouraging and, and if you're willing and gusto kong ma-feel pa yung ganto, more of this fulfillment. So let me just make a short pitch to Joseph, the owner of Alpha Gen's Leather. Hopefully someday we could make a collaboration merch, something like um, an everyday leather camera bag or kind of a camera leather slap. Because those are the things that I'm gonna use and I'll have no problem promoting it. So yon, hopefully one day we could we could make that possible. So if so, I just want to put it here in this video, so that if ever that day happens, or if that happens, I mean, you heard it here first. Hopefully, then I could work with more small local businesses and small local brands. Uh, I hope that I empower you, my business niyo or your brands niyo with with my uh, content creation skill. So if you want, if you have an idea and you want to work with me or collaborate with me, you can send your idea with uh, workwithjack at gmail.com. And I just want to be transparent lang uh, with, my, with my work. I couldn't deliver views or attention to something that I couldn't control. But what I could promise to deliver is to make a good piece quality of content. Just to set things straight, yun lang yung kaya I promise. I could promise to make you a good quality video or a good quality content. So in lang, please don't send shady ideas. Let's keep it clean. Let's keep it close up. And if you're still watching up to this point ng video, uh, I hope you're having a great time. And again, thanks for watching. Before you click out of the video na lang, please don't forget to hit the like button and consider subscribing if you aren't already. And see you in the next one. Bye!